It's okay for men to have extra hair on the face, but for women, I don't think so. Women may develop excessive facial hair due to higher than normal levels of androgens, including testosterone. All women produce androgens, but the levels typically remain low. Certain medical conditions can cause a woman to produce too many androgens that cause more hair on the face. Facial hair is an issue that many women prefer to keep quiet, with secret trips to the beauty salon or private bleaching sessions at home. While all women have fine, light hair covering their faces and bodies, for some women this hair can be thicker, coarser and more visible. In this video, we present to you 10 gentle and permanent ways to remove facial hair in women. If you are new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button to keep you updated with our latest videos. We are making sure to give you the best health and beauty videos, regularly. Let's start with the gentle ways first which are easy to execute even by yourself at home. 1. Tweezing. This is the cheapest method of removing facial hair. It's most commonly the go-to way to keep your eyebrows tamed. The major downsides are only that it is time-consuming and somewhat painful, especially in sensitive areas. It is highly recommended wiping the tips of tweezers before and after every use with a cotton pad wet with rubbing or ethyl alcohol or an alcohol wipe, then letting them dry. And you should always store tweezers inside a protective pouch. 2. Shaving. Whether you're using a disposable shaver or an electric shaver, shaving is one of the easiest ways to get rid of facial hair. However, the results aren't permanent or long-lasting. Your face will remain hair-free for 1-3 to three days, and then you'll have to re-shave. For the best results, clean your face and apply a layer of soap or shaving cream. This promotes a smooth surface and reduces the likelihood of cuts. Glide the shaver over your face in the direction of hair growth. 3. Use a depilatory cream. A depilatory is a strong alkaline product that breaks down hair so that it can be easily wiped off. Gone are the days when depilatory creams were pungently scented, there are lots of new ones that are gentle and fragrance-free. Using creams to remove facial hair is a little bit better than shaving the face because it doesn't usually create as sharp a tip as a razor does. Results will only last you for a couple of days at the most. Just be careful because hair removal creams contain harsh chemicals and can burn your skin, especially the delicate area of the face. 4. Try an epilator. An epilator is a device, which works by pulling out multiple hairs at once. While effective, fast, and relatively inexpensive, it can be painful the first few times it's used. Like with waxing, however, the pain lessens over time as you become used to the sensation. 5. Waxing. Waxing is a favorite method for ridding facial hair for up to six weeks using a resin wax. Waxing service is found in salons and spas everywhere, and a wide variety of home kits are sold. Waxing is exfoliating and can cause extreme redness, scabs, or burns if you're already using powerful exfoliators on your face like salicylic acid, alpha-hydroxy acid, or enzymes. Waxing lasts about four weeks. 6. Coil Hair Removers. Maybe you have seen these little gadgets advertised for women's facial hair removal. They look like tiny slinkies that grab your hair out of the root. Think tweezing, but so much faster, because you don't have to grab each hair individually. Epicare and Lindo are two possible choices. For more information on these products, please check the link provided below. 7. Remove facial hair by threading. Threading is a very common practice in Middle Eastern and Asian countries that involves using a thin, doubled cotton thread pulled super taut to roll over spots where you wish to remove hairs, thus pulling them out. While it isn't quite as labor-intensive as plucking hairs one at a time, it works best on smaller areas such as the eyebrows, upper lip, and cheeks. And unlike using tweezers, threading is much trickier to try if you've never been trained in it, so head to a salon with a professional who specializes in it for the best results. Now let's move on to the more permanent solutions to getting rid of facial hair in women. 1. Electrolysis. Electrolysis, which uses concentrated heat to destroy each follicle one at a time to prohibit hairs from growing. This is an ideal method for folks who want permanent hair removal but can't do laser removal because their hairs are light or fuzzy. The method with the best track record and the only method approved by the FDA for permanent hair removal is electrolysis. 
2. Hair Removal Using Laser Laser This is an FDA-approved method of permanent hair reduction, meaning that over time the hair that returns will be thinner and lighter, and possibly eventually not return at all after many treatments. This process uses light pulses to destroy the root of the hair. It doesn't automatically remove the hair but does cause it to fall out over time. It works best for those with dark hair and light skin. 3. Try Hormone Treatments. If your hair's thickness and color are hormone-based, make sure to verify this with your doctor first, you may be able to return the hair to normal by using hormone treatments or oral contraceptives, which also regulate the hormones. Consult with your doctor about your options and condition. The above permanent treatments though should be done with caution, each of the above procedures has associated risks. Before undergoing any, it is a good idea to consult with your doctor about those associated health risks. For example, electrolysis cannot be used if you have a pacemaker. You and your doctor will also need to consider underlying health conditions. There are a number of conditions, some benign and easy to treat while others can be more worrying, which can cause more hair growth or hair growth in unusual areas. Have you tried any of the above methods? Which ones do you prefer? Let us know your experiences and share them in the comments section below. This way, you can also inform other women which methods are more effective. Facial hair can be attractive for some men but can be annoying for women. Getting rid of unwanted hair is an easy fix. Depending on the chosen method, you can get rid of hair for days, weeks, or months. So, make sure to choose wisely which one is right for you. Thanks for watching, The Health Room.